Okay, take two. I'm trying to get this going. I want to do another live feed for you guys. Goodness, this hair um, is so windy, but it has warmed up and it is actually really nice out here. So I am going to walk around and see if I can't introduce you guys to some more beautiful people here at the Homesteaders of America conference. Hello, how are you doing? Y'all tell me where you're watching from. Um, tell me if you caught my earlier live stream. I've got that up. Um, but I know that y'all were really enjoying seeing this. And earlier I started that live stream. I, I didn't actually realize that Joel Salatin was speaking at that time. So a lot of people were caught up in that. And um, the event is winding down. We've got just a little while left, just a couple hours, and I'm uh, really excited. Some people have started to leave, but there's still a lot of wonderful people here and a lot of really great stuff going on. So thank y'all so much. I just love it. I've seen lots of from Florida, North Carolina, I saw Kentucky a little while ago, um, Texas. Do I have any arc our Kansans in the house. I have not run into Jason from Cog Hill Farm. I didn't know if he was here or not. I haven't seen him. Um, this is uh, this has definitely been a really cool thing. I don't. I think the other live video is up. If you want to go back and watch that, we got to talk to some different people on that. Um, I'm gonna go give my camera to Maya. He's standing right up here. Actually, he is standing here talking to some people that y'all might want to see. So let's go up here and say hello to some of our friends that we've been chatting with. Who is that? <laughs> you want to say hey? There's the Pratt. You want to say hey? Hey, how you doing? Pratt Family Homestead having fun here. Yeah, this is one of our favorites. We love this family. I keep telling them that I'm going to hit them up with all my questions whenever we get our pigs here in just a couple of weeks. They have a great channel if you don't follow it yet. You should be. It's Pratt Family Homestead. Thank you very much. And they're doing a really awesome thing, so it's Thank really you. cool. Yeah, they're saying hi. Pratt's in the house. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. All right, so I just dropped my camera off with Maya, so he's been my pack mule this time. Um, let's go over here and see. Um, so Eustace Conway is here. That's pretty cool. He's got a crowd around his tent right now, so maybe we'll come back. Um, I just got to listen to him in the Q&A talking about um, talking about learning to build and talking about some different things. It was really, really neat. I want to go uh, go back and and look up more and read more from him and talk more um, to him. So he's a really incredibly interesting man. Um, I see a couple here that I think you guys would probably be pretty excited to hear from. They're talking to somebody, so I'm gonna wait patiently. Um, I try to be mindful on these things whenever we're meeting people that, um, you know, to not just spread in, but it is really exciting. Okay, so. Is this, is this cool for y'all? Who, who was I most excited to see? Well, I mean, this clown. <laughs> Guys, the duck. <laughs> I want to grab, hey, you want to say hey? This is Stacy. I'll come back and talk. To, I'll grab them whenever they don't have somebody talking to them. But yeah, um, who was I most excited to see? It's been really cool to meet some of the people that have become my friends online. Like, it's been cool to meet them in person. Um, Rebecca Rhodes, uh, she and I have become friends online and just being able to talk to her and just hug her. Like, after, you know, I mean, like you talk to somebody and you just, you get to know them and you come to really care about them and just getting to hug her and be in person with her, that was really cool. Uh, meeting Luke and my gardener, that was really cool for me because I've learned so much from him and I've watched his videos. Um, Thank you so much, Renee. I'm glad you're here watching. Uh, but yeah, Luke, watching his videos for so long, he was cool to meet. And then he blew my mind and told me that he watched my channel and started referencing all my videos. And I'm sitting there like picking my jaw up off the floor, like, you're joking. Like, are you kidding me right now? So that was pretty cool. Um, getting to know him and his wife some more. I really got to hang out with them a lot. Where are all the animals? Um, Y'all wanna see some animals? There aren't very many here. Now, Penny, Happy Days Farm, she's a pretty, got a pretty large Instagram presence. Um, 
tell the Rhodes family that the Mighty Man movie was awesome. Wasn't that really neat? Um, he's sort of really gifted in filmmaking. He's put so much work into that and he just does a really good job. But uh, Penny was here earlier. She had her little rabbit that she always posts sugar. And then this family has brought some of their goaties, which is funny. They look so much like my goaties. Um, specifically that little black and white one over the corner, y'all recognize. Doesn't that look like my girl Nestle? Any of you guys got heirloom pumpkins? Have you met out of Goshen? No, I haven't met them. I need to figure out where they, I don't, I don't know them. I've got to look them up. Um, thank you, Jennifer. I really appreciate that. I love, I love sharing devotionals with you guys. Can I be honest? Those are some of the hardest videos to get out because they're the ones that get the most opposition, but they're the ones that get the most ref, like, like affirmation as well. So I guess that's kind of how it is. Anytime you want to do anything well, it's, um, Hey, that's my kid. Hey, Ben. Ben, can you say hi to everybody on YouTube? No? Okay. Well, they love you, okay? So, <laughs> the children here are so fun. It's There's so many kids. Hold my hand. Um, so, there is just so much going on. So many kids, so many families here. It's really neat because, like, these families that we hi, hi. I'm to steal you when you were done. I didn't right, want well, to hi. interrupt you. This is YouTube. Oh. Hi YouTube. Oh geez. What's your name? My name's Claire. Hi Claire. Um, and I've just been seeing you around. I'm a new subscriber of yours, and I just wanted to say hi. Hi. Well, thank you, hi. Claire. <laughs> it's so nice to meet you. I'm nice glad you're you. with I us. I didn't mean to interrupt you. Now you're fine. Hi, YouTube. Say hi to Claire. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> She's a new subscriber. Yeah. <laughs> so that's awesome. Thank you, Claire. Thanks yeah. for saying hello. <laughs> so, um. Oh, there's my baby. Sorry, my child ran away. Come on, love. Let's walk. Um, so it is really exciting to me to get to, for my kids to get to come play with all of the other children of the people that I watch regularly. The funniest thing happened today. Um, I was in the Q and A and I was sitting there, um, I was sitting there with my children and I had kind of tucked us away in the back where they wouldn't be distracting because you know, I've got five kids and uh, three of them are six and under so like they can get a little out of hand and so we're sitting in the back and Benjamin is sitting next to, to me he's three and um, Justin and Rebecca are up on the panel well we watch the roads that's like one of the channels that we watch pretty regularly and that Ben watches he watches like almost all of their videos he put he, we put them on and he sits at the computer and watches them well um, hey baby will you go get Ben please um, so he, he watches them and, um, he looks up on the screen and he sees Justin and he said, oh, and he turned and looked at me, he said, who is that man with, with the hat on his head? And I was like, that's Justin Rhodes. And he said, oh, he got out of the computer and we were like, yeah. And he, I mean, he like fanned out so hard. I'm talking like completely. I mean, he almost cried. He was like, it's Justin Rhodes. It's just, he stood up on his seat. He's waving. We're all the way in the back. He's like, Justin Rhodes, Justin Rhodes. It's me, Ben. It's me, Ben. <laughs> he was saying it over and over. It was the funniest thing. So stinking cute. And I don't think it had really clicked in his little three-year-old mind that the people that we watch on the computer are real people who, um, you know, who just, they're just like us and we're one of them. Hey, Daniel, I've seen it so many comments are going so fast, so I'm just trying to catch them as, as I can. But um, there's also so much going on right now. Um, and there's just people everywhere, which is really cool. I want to I want to introduce you guys to people. I'm trying to make sure that my child made it back to where my, uh, my other boys are. He did, so I'm good. Um, it's kind of crazy because we do have so many families and so many kids running around and playing. And of course the kids want to keep up with them, but I don't, I try not to be a helicopter mom, but it's just in me. <laughs> like, so I'm just like, I need to know where they are. Um, oh, thank you so much, Cynthia. I've been taking as much footage as I can. I wanted to make sure that I did the live videos that you guys could see what was going on. Yeah, y'all are saying hey to Daniel. Yeah, Daniel's here. He texted me as soon as my other video is over. Can I get y'all for a second? Oh, sure, girl. Oh, you sure can. Are we live? What are we live Hi. on? We're live on YouTube. Hey, YouTubers. Hi, YouTube. YouTube! <laughs> <laughs> That's 
Like, so what are y'all thinking of this? We love coming oh, to all it's these amazing. conferences. If you guys are not coming to these conferences, wherever they are, if you can find one by you, you're missing out. There's yeah. a lot of information, a lot of like-minded people, a lot of mentorship. It's like a big family it's here. It's really good we stuff. We love it. So make plans for 2019 to try to hit a homesteading conference near you. Awesome. Thank you guys so much. Yeah. Yeah. We, we love, love her. Yeah. <laughs> bye. 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 It's Doug and Stacy off grid with Doug and Stacy. If you don't already follow them, they're a great one. And yes, I saw somebody say, um, I saw somebody say about, will I link these channels? I can't right now on my phone live, but I will come through after the fact when this video replays and I'll add them down below so that you guys can check them out. Um, okay, so the roads just got done talking and all the people are coming out so we'll just we'll have more people to chat with in just a moment so there's a lot okay hold on i see somebody hold on one second let's turn around here yes okay so let's go here let's see who we can find where's where's your lady she's walking this way okay you want to talk to you too? Sure. Cool. Are you live? I'm live. Oh my gosh. I'm taking my friends around the conference because they couldn't be here. So. I, think the, I think you're the only person who has done a live. I have not seen anybody go live. I did live earlier today too. So we we're... Did you really? Did you? Awesome. You want to... Hi. Hi. Where'd she go? I'm Amanda. Hi Amanda, will you tell everybody about what you're doing since you did live yesterday? They might want to go watch your live videos. Oh, well. <laughs> I'm, uh, what I did yesterday was we just kind of went live and talked about everything that's going on. Hi. Awesome. Where can they find that? Uh, we're uh, Fundamental Home is our YouTube channel. The Fundamental Home. So yeah, we're, we're just hanging out with all the wonderful people and just enjoying the awesome conversation. Awesome. Yeah. So the Fundamental Home, if you want to find that, I'm gonna link all these later. But oh. we're just right Thank now you. we're just throwing them out there so people can check it out because a lot of people have been like, I want more footage. I want to see what's going on. I know. The people who wish they could be here, I understand that. It wasn't possible for everybody so we're gonna make it possible by carrying them around with us so we're gonna wait on meg to get back over here and we're gonna talk to ben and meg from the hauler homestead they have a really neat channel that's going in on um they've been traveling all over the country with their kids in an rv sarah you're oh i wish you were here sarah y'all we've been hanging out with ethan from 180 degrees from average and sarah is not here with him but she just commented so i'm glad you're on here sarah and i wish you were here with us but we're gonna get to hang out soon we're gonna make it happen one way or another even though you live in the frigid north maybe you'll have to come down to the south for the winter <laughs> like a goose <laughs> all right let's see so we're gonna hang back here um i love all the names of these homesteads how is the seed swap? The seed swap was really cool. Um, several people brought a whole lot of stuff. People brought seeds that they had saved. And um, and so it was really cool. And, and honestly, a few people came. And a lot of people were like, oh, I don't have to come. We don't have seeds. And we're like, no, come. We will hook you up. And so a lot of people got to come and uh, and and get some seeds. Like one woman had said she had lost all, all of her seeds in a flood. So that really was really touching to me that she kind of got some restoration in that like she got back some of what she had lost because of just the generosity of others so it was a really cool thing we got to share a lot um the fit farmers family mike dixon and lacy were here yesterday and they just got back from going and visiting baker creek and so they had tons of seeds that they brought and of course i had a bunch from baker creek that they had brought me down um as a gift after my mother-in-law passed away so we brought a lot of the extra seeds we had and just shared them with people and it was really really neat i really enjoyed that for sure so um let's see let me see if i can find anybody else in here homestead tessie i don't know i want to say someone said something but i don't really know um not being able to find your seeds so yeah i wish y'all i wish the thing about these that they're like the real downside about stuff like this is you always wish more people could be here like even with everybody that's here i wish that like the online community like i wish that everybody could come together and take part in this it would be really incredible here's miss rose again she was here with me earlier but How's your life? Hi. Hi. <laughs> 
What's got, will you introduce yourself to the, these people in case they don't already know you? I know we do a lot together, so they... Absolutely, absolutely. I'm Rose, Wholesome Roots. I'm looking for Crocs. Wholesome Roots, there it is. <laughs> Like needlework, do you your logo yesterday? Like in, yes, that embroidery yes, or needlework? Yes. Um, brought her this gift. That was so yeah, incredible. I was that was really so excited. precious. That that was Stephen from Brown Coat Homestead. That is yeah, so so sweet. He made sweet. that for me and brought it to the conference. I was like, oh, I like cried a little bit. Yeah, Rose put together the seat. They were just talking about the seat swap and thinking Excellent. that was really cool. So she was that was it her. Was fun. That was her brainchild to bring all that together. It was yeah. really awesome. I think I got a lot of good stuff that I wasn't expecting to. I was just expecting to like give. And then it was like, people walked up with like something I was like, ooh, I, I don't that. have that. <laughs> yeah. I may have a huge seed collection, but I don't have that. <laughs> yeah, it is really awesome. So y'all yeah. go check out Rose, Wholesome Roots. She does lots of great gardening stuff and goat stuff. She knows lots about goats. <laughs> I love so. my goats. I miss my goats. <laughs> I know. I'm Isn't so that hard? <laughs> I, Bye. Right, Thank you later. so much. Oh, is that Ethan's get That's up? That's Ethan's yes. get up. Yeah. That's our drool in it. All right, guys. All right. You oh, hey, are we live? You're live. live. Oh, no wow. Throw me on the spot. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, he knew. <laughs> go, go get your mom. Yeah. It's like, okay. <laughs> All right, so we are Ben and Meg of the Holler Homestead. We are extremely crazy people. Yeah. We sold everything and <laughs> are traveling, traveling to find our new homestead, wherever that is. We don't know yet. We have not natural Traveled about a little over half this country. Yeah. Seen a lot. This country's really big. In case it is. Like, it's really big. Once you drive across Especially when you're traveling with how many children? Four kids. Four, four, four kids. Boys. Four yes. boys. In an yeah. RV? Yeah. yeah. RV. And it's just. Yeah. Wow. So where have you been to Arkansas yet? yet? No, not yet. not yet. That's part of the South. Yeah. Are, They're coming. They're coming. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited because my roots are in the South. So I'm just like, I'm going home. That's awesome. Where are you originally Louisiana. from? From Louisiana. Okay, so you're not. <laughs> my also, family is. Yeah. I'm born and raised in California. But awesome. All my family. Well, uh, yeah. Y'all, yeah. they're going to have to make a stop at yeah. Reason Refuge Farm. Uh, yeah. Me, me and your like doppelganger. Okay. <laughs> no. Dude. Dude. Okay, so we're standing here talking. And we're talking about how old we are. He's like, yeah, I'm 33, almost 24, or 34. I was like, what? Almost 33. He's like, well, what month? I was like, December. And he goes, what day? I said, the 28th. He's not. Yeah. We have the same birthday. He's just a year older He's than you. He's just a year older. Okay, no so way. Ben keeps getting stopped. He did when he first he got there. People would be like, hey, Maya. And he's like, no, who's Maya? And then finally they come face to face and they're like. It's like, okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and he walks up to Jeremiah and he's like, you're Maya. And he's like, okay, I can see it. <laughs> it's really cool. kind of funny. So they no call their doppelganger. That's yes. really crazy. That's crazy. That's cool. okay. well, I'm excited hey, for He just like gives me this crazy look. He's like, you're messing with me. Aren't you? Like, oh. Oh, That's awesome. I'm excited for you guys to come to Arkansas. Oh, heck yeah. We're excited. It's going to be awesome. Sick. We'll let all our boys converge into a boy herd in oh, the backyard. I love that. I love that. All right, I'm going to walk. I'll all see right. you later. All right, let's walk out of this barn. Let's go find somewhere else to go. Oh. Oh, you both at the oh. same time. I just got here. I was I was trying to grab you earlier, but I had we had a mess up thing. So, okay. Amy, <laughs> yeah, I just talked to Rose. Yeah. <laughs> so here is beautiful Amy, who is the oh, brain behind this you. and the work, and she has put so much into it. I've seen your sweet husband and son just walking yes, around there, right around troopers. Everywhere. So yeah, Amy Fuel Fuel Homestead. Such an incredible woman. Oh my gosh, look how sunburnt my face is. <laughs> You've been working so hard. So she has an amazing channel where she shares so much wisdom. It's about doing things um, naturally and just doing just so much with her. Y'all have like an acre. Or less, half acre. Half acre. Do an incredible amount on a small space. I send people to your channel all the time when they're like, oh, I can't really oh, homestead right. yet. I'm like, yes, you can. Oh, you but can. you absolutely you can. Lot, can. And I'm like, you have got to go see what my friend's doing. They have half an acre and, you know, you know less. Yep. It's a yard. You yeah, know, yeah, like. You can I mean, have a, a pretty big garden. We have meat rabbits. We have chickens and ducks. And yeah, you're doing a lot. You can do that so that's bit. really cool. Thank you so much for putting this on. Yeah, thank Amazing. you. Amazing. So well done. Just so thoughtful. Okay, what was your favorite part? I know, it's Just a the question. community. I mean, like. Battery's low. Oh, man. <laughs> Our battery's low. So we'll hang around while we can. I just got her book and I'm loving it. Her channel is The Fuel Homestead. F E W E L L. Yep, I and you said right? it right, too. 
Yeah, you talk. Justin, about that. Rhodes, <laughs> Justin Rhodes, when he put me on his channel the other day, he called me Amy <laughs> Foo. <or> something like <laughs> that. <laughs> and you're like, no, that's what happens whenever you've just read something. So. I know, I know. <laughs> Doug has photobombed this Doug. video no less than like six times. <laughs> I'm going to go on right before you, okay? All right, so I'm going to let her go, get back to her job. Yes. Thank you so much. Thank I you will link her channel. When I go back and add all the links, I will add those on So See you later. See ya. <laughs> Are, are you? <laughs> okay. Okay, so the funny thing about this, so do you think there may come a time where you sell seeds from your homestead? Yes, I'm going to do that eventually. Talking to Luke and my gardener um, this trip, it really encouraged me. Do you know that Luke packs every single seed pack that he sells? Now he has a staff and they have a store and, and once he packs them, they go on and are dealt with by everybody else, but he actually packs every, every seed pack that they sell. And that was so encouraging to me because I was like, if he can do that, I can do it. So, um, let's see. I'm kind of trying to. Cool. Yes. Okay. Oh, are you talking about Ben? Did he tell yeah, you? Yeah, he told us that y'all have the same birthday. <laughs> the same birthday a year apart. That's I crazy. Him, you know, I was like, I was like, oh, how old are you? He's like 33. I'm like, when do you turn 34? I was like, I'm turning 34 this year. He, he just goes, told us. He's like, I'm turning 34 in December. I'm like, what day? He's like, 28th. I'm like, quit messing. <laughs> I was like, who told you what my birthday was? He's like, no, seriously, 28th. That's so crazy. And I was like, that's wild. Yeah, Doug keeps photobombing me over and over again. <laughs> that's been the experience of this trip. That's Doug, though. Um, all right, I'm going to walk down this way, okay? So. Okay. Okay. Um, my battery is kind of low, but we're going to go while we can go. So, um, let's see. You bought a lot from Luke. Yeah, he has really great stuff. He is so precious. Like, talking to him and his wife just made me... Um, just made me so encouraged to just support them. Do you know what, like, I, I keep saying this and I'm not trying to like be disrespectful. He is 24 years old. Can you believe that? Like he started his YouTube channel when he was in high school and has got that kind of success. It's just incredible. He's such a sincere person. Um, and I just think that is just really incredible. I, I have supported his channel for a long time and, and you know, bought stuff. I've bought some, grown a lot of his seeds, but I just, you know, you learn stuff and you feel even better about it. So. Um, so here is Miss Kaylee. I got some footage with her earlier. She has um, the Mangalitsa pigs, and she's on Instagram as the farm on Quail Hollow. Um, really neat Instagram channel. She just started a YouTube channel, the farm on Quail Hollow. If you look that up, um, and it is small right now, but she's growing, and she's going to do amazing. She's going to have a lot of really incredible content. Um, they, they do everything. They say they do from bacon to, to from bees to bacon and everything in between got a sub him oh where I was talking about Luke I think is who you're asking about Vicki uh, in my gardener which he's got a really big channel um, and just incredibly brilliant when it comes to gardening he shares so much information so this is a really neat thing right here he's talking to somebody right now so this is hand hewn farm let me show you guys And right here is a two and a half year aged prosciutto, which I tasted earlier and was some of the most amazing tasted meat that I have ever tried in my life. Not joking, like it was absolutely amazing. So they do a lot of curing and stuff. They're on Instagram, Hand Hewn Farm. Um, not Instagram, they're on, uh, they are on Instagram, but they're also on um, YouTube. That's what I'm looking for on YouTube. So we've come over here, I think. I took you guys over here earlier. Ah, uh, I see somebody I wanna introduce you to. Um, ben and Maya, you see it too? I can see it. It was kind of funny. Like, we were sitting there like really inspecting them. Like, do you look like, yeah, you kind of do. You kind of have the same hairline and the facial hair. Um, yes, Catherine, I love sharing like this. I'm glad to be able to do this. Um, I have done a lot of video and I'm hoping to put some videos together of this event, but I have all my kids with me. Am I on Facebook? Yeah, I am. Um, Jessica Sowards, if you look me up, there's not a lot of us. Um, but yeah, just, you can type in Jessica Sowards, Arkansas, and that should probably pull me up on Facebook. So um, let's come over here and meet these folks. I don't want to interrupt their conversation. So yeah, but this is really cool to be able to do it live because I can bring you guys around, show you, give you an opportunity to see the event. Um, and also, you know, I've got my kids, so if I'm a little distracted, it's okay. 
um, ban on hardiness approach and thought it was Maya. That's funny. That is really funny, like, that people think that. He had, uh, he had multiple people stopping him, being like, Maya? And he, he was like, no. But we got to meet for the first time. When are my pigs coming? We are going to pick them up in Missouri um, in a couple of weeks. We actually purchased them just a few days after Jeremiah's mom died, and they gave, um, they gave me, us some extra time to come get them. They're super sweet people up there. Um, so... So, uh, yeah, so we're going to go get them. We're also going to go to Baker Creek again um, at the end of uh, either the end of October, the beginning of November. We're going to go get the pigs, and we're going to go up to Baker Creek, and I'm going to do some video for you guys of, like, their distribution center and just checking out, you know, what they have. Mangalitsa pigs. Not, but it's a pretty rare be breed. Kaylee from the farm on Quail Hollow that I just showed you briefly, her her stand, um, she's my friend on Instagram. And um, she is a really, it's the farm on Quail Hollow. And she's the one who has Mangalitsas. And that's how I became aware of the breed. They were nearly extinct in the 90s. And as of right now, um, there are about 60,000 of them. So it, I had to track them down. I've been waiting. The reason we don't have pigs yet is because I've been waiting specifically to get that breed of pig. I wanted those. I've wanted them for about a, a year now. And uh, I'm just waiting. Yes, I'm coming to Baker Creek in Missouri. And the sun did come out, praise the Lord. It's so much warmer. Um, I'm coming to Baker Creek in Missouri at the end of this month or next month to video and to visit them. And then Baker Creek's Spring Planting Festival will be in May. And I will, always be, I will also be at that. I'll be speaking at that. So um, that's going to be in May. I, don't, I can't think of the dates off the top of my head. But I will keep you guys... Uh, completely posted on that whenever that's going on and also coming up there in a couple weeks I'll keep you guys posted on that as well hey can I get you guys for a second we're, we're all live right now hey look at these up? all come on <laughs> so here's a couple of beautiful people we've got y'all well y'all introduce let me turn you around so I can sure. so tell I know we got two separate channels here here's Jason which I just heard him talking about trapping and some really amazing information on the Q&A that was really cool we got Becky Right, Beautiful Becky. And I'm Jake. <laughs> <laughs> He's he belongs to Becky. <laughs> so White House on the Hill and Big Bear Homestead, a couple more of the awesome channels that are here right now. Sweet families we've gotten to meet and spend some time with. So it's really cool. Y'all make sure to go follow them. Hi guys. All right. We'll see y'all later. Thank you. Okay, those are two more really awesome channels. Uh, White House on the Hill and Big Bear Homestead. I came by earlier and um, met Robin from uh, Big Bear Homestead and she actually, Jeremiah went up and Ben, his little ears were so cold this morning and we went by and she has all her crocheted stuff and Jeremiah uh, said, can you make a hat for my son? And she's like, yeah, give me 20 minutes. And so she actually made a hat for Ben this morning, which was the coolest thing. And so he's really proud of it. He's been carrying around his little hat uh, now that it's warmed up and he doesn't want to wear it anymore. Yeah, that was Big Bear Homestead, Jason, and then um, Jake and Becky from White House on the Hill. Lots of YouTube homesteaders here. Um, this is kind of really like, I don't know, I guess the Mother Earth News thing in Asheville might be, um, might be kind of a big YouTube homesteader event, but this may, I think this may be like the event of the year. Um, so, Hey, let's see. I'm kind of walking around and seeing if there's anything else I should cover before I cut this off. My phone is almost dead. Look at this, okay? Look at these kids all playing. There's Ben. He's made friends. And they're playing here. Um, ask someone if they seen Oh, gosh. Let me see. Oh, who can I ask that? Let me go ask Jake. He might, he knows everybody. Um, let's go see if there is a farm in Ohio. They have the woolly pigs. Cool. Um, am I planning on going to any other events this year or the beginning of next year? Um, Deep South Homestead does one. I think it's in March. 
don't quote me. I'm pretty sure it's on my calendar, but I can't think of it off the top of my head. I don't have my calendar. I'm pretty sure there is, is in March. And um, have, I'm, yes, I met Hardiness Approach. I got to meet them. They're super sweet people. Uh, I met them yesterday and I have not seen them around today, but I, I don't know if they're here. I'm thinking that they're here. Okay, yes, March. Thank you, Christy. Deep South has one in March. We're gonna go to that. Uh, we're gonna go down there and, and meet them. And then we'll be in Baker Creek in May. And there is a family that's local to me that has a small YouTube channel um, named their VW Family Farms. Um, and they live about 45 minutes away from me. And I have been talking with them about the possibility of organizing an Arkansas meetup for Arkansas and surrounding areas to come and meet up, both YouTubers and then also, you know, viewers and people who watch us and support our channels. There's Big Bear again. I wanna come to Arkansas. Yeah, come on down. Yeah. My wife graduated from Arkansas. Did you really? Yeah. I graduated from the University of Arkansas. I can't I get her, I can't, if you're in Arkansas, help me. I can never get her to call the Hawks. She won't do it. You won't do it? You won't woo pig? Nope. Not even once? Not, not even, even for once. an Arkansas girl? Come on. I think y'all should do it together. I think you should do it while I was in school there. I think you should do it together. Why did you do this to me? It's getting retarded. But yeah, I didn't even do it while I was at school. Well, I'll take a rain check on that big Another time. Right? <laughs> yeah, so I mean, we're going we're gonna to talk about that and figure out when a good time would be. Yeah. Um, yeah, Pratt Family Homestead was on the begin, the very beginning of this video. So whenever I go to replay this live, or you know, whenever it's posted, you can check that out. Um, I've got to spend some time with them. I got some video of them, and then um, had a good chat. Jeremiah was was asked, well, who was I looking for? I was looking for Jake because I was going to ask him about out of Goshen, and now I can't find him. Hmm. All right, let's walk this way. Um, yeah, like Jake from White House, he like knows everybody. So I keep, I'm like, he, he's like, that's so-and-so and that's so-and-so. I'm kind of new to this scene. So we just got and kind of got into the YouTube community this year. So I'm still meeting a lot of people for the first time. And um, that's really cool because I like meeting new people. But I'll be excited whenever I know everybody. So I'll feel better about that. Um, my phone just told me again that I'm almost out of battery. So I probably need to wrap this up so I don't lose you guys very abruptly. Um... Thank you all so much for watching. This has been really awesome. We're actually, yeah, it's really about to die. We, um, we're actually heading home tomorrow. We're gonna, we're gonna leave tomorrow morning. And no, what, no, Lauren, which one was it? I, the comments are going so fast on here. I can't, literally, it only shows two at a time, so it goes really fast. Um, and sometimes I'm not seeing them on my phone. Um, I'll hang on a second to see if there was something. Lauren kind of monitors my stuff for me. It's one of my best friends. And so she usually watches stuff. So if she says I need to see something, I'm going to wait because <laughs> I believe her. <laughs> so uh, we're going to leave in the morning. We're actually going to go. We're going to be stopping on our way home at a couple of friends' house and uh, spending some time with them that... I, I think y'all are going to be excited to see a little bit of that. So these are some friends that you guys know. So um, they weren't able to be here. And then I think after that we're going to come on home. So I'm going to hang on. Just say hi to Jeanette. Oh, oh okay. Her. Say hi to Jeanette. Okay, cool. I will, I will go back and check that out. So. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm gonna get off here because I've seen a couple people kind of hesitate off in the side and I think they were wanting to talk to me and I'd, I don't think they wanted to interrupt me while I was doing that. So I'm gonna get off here so I can be available for this last little bit. I am tired, but we'll be able to, to get, um, we'll be able to get through, through it and get home. So thank you guys so much. I bless you, thank you for watching and I will have, this video you'll be able to rewatch. I did a live earlier, you'll be able to rewatch, and I am doing some video to put together for y'all to be able to see more of the conference and lots of. Uh... So, hi, Jeanette. I see. So, she's 77. She felt... Okay, I got it. Hi, Jeanette. <laughs> I'm so glad that you watch, and I really appreciate your support. And I'm just, I love being able to share with you guys. I, I don't know how to express 
how fully this is the infinitely more to my dream. Like I dreamed of having the homestead life for so, so long. And so to get to be able to come here to share it with you, just to get to be able to come blows my mind. To get to be able to come and be the leverage point that you all get to see it just is, it's incredibly humbling. It is such a blessing. It is such a gift. And I just, I love to share with y'all. Thank you guys. Thank you, Renee. Thank you, Jeanette. Thank you, the rest of you. I love you all. I bless you. Until next time. Hi, how are you?